welcome to the new video tutorial guys this is me Ron and in this video tutorial I'm gonna show you how to send SMS or message to anyone for free using CSAP in fact we can send free message to anyone from online for free directly but you can send message or SMS to anyone using email so this is the cool feature all right now let's do it i also make the video on how to send message from psp in comparison to the process using psp it is far more easier in CISA because in psp we have to download on more extra software that is send mail and have to configure psp.inf file but we do not need to do all this tedious thing in c -sharp. now let's do it similar in psp you need to choose the carrier from where you want to send messages there are various carrier like AT&T, T-Mobile and many more for more carrier you can google it but I am using txtlocal.co.uk is my carrier open browser any browsing software you have and then go to txtlocal.com and sign up here after signing up the txtlocal.com will send you the verification email in your email address and go to your email address and open the verification link after clicking on the verification link you will redirect to the new pages in that pages you need to input some important information and then press active my account I already done this step so and after verifying your activate after activating your account go to your setting and then click on email to SMS after click on Clicking on email to SMS, you will redirect to the new web pages, and in that web page, you will see this web pages, and then click on active email to SMS checkbox, and this is whatever option you like from here, choose your default name, and truncate your message, and subject heading from here. And click on save setting after completing this step you are successful in choosing your carrier next step is to design form and write the code now open Visual Studio and click on file new and then project from here select Visual C -Sub and Windows and Windows form application and Keep the name of our project and then press OK. Now extend the form and drag some labels from here. This is for phone number. Go to port copy and change the label text. Phone number. And this is the Gmail account. Your Gmail account that is used in creating the textlocal.co.uk account. So you need to use that Gmail account here. And here goes the Gmail password. And here goes the message you want to send to that number. Now drag for text box 
from the toolbar drop over here click this text box associated with the message and from the property of the text box I'll go to multi-line view and then change the scroll bar both now drag this Drag on button and go to the property and change the text send and change the variable name that is the text of this of this all text box from the property txt on Words txt cement words txt pass and enters txt message and change the button and the tn send now double click on both send button and you need to add use some namespace using system dot net and one more using system dot net dot mail Now go to that button and define the variable that is your phone number, mail, message, and then password. Now you need to use on plus mail message mail message message is equal to mail mail message and then you store the value that you are entering that you enter in the on our text field txt on dot text dot to string because and CSR all variable are treated in string from txt signal dot Text dot to string message is to retrieve the message from this message text field and then also convert it to string. Same procedure process for getting password
now message dot to dot edit we want to send the message to this number so get the message to that number again message dot from is equal to new valid this we get the email address here and then message body message dot body from this variable mess again SMTP client SMTP client SMTP is equal to new SMTP client. I will use the SMTP of Google Gmail that is SMTP dot gmail dot com now enable the SSL that means secure socket layer SMTP dot enable SSL is equal to true it gives the boolean value that is either true or false SMTP dot put send the port address 587 generally 587 is used smtp dot delivery method is equal to smtp delivery method dot method smtp dot gradient fields is equal to new network gradient fields that goes your the parameter goes your QD mirror this and then your password let's try SMTP dot send goods message the message box suits so message box dot so send successfully message message box button dot ok message box icon dot information get exception exception ex message box but so ex dot message now let's run the program Before this, go to design password and go to property.
on the program and here you need to enter the mobile number with the country code 9779 and you need to put a root sign and your carrier my carrier is txt local dot co dot uk and here's your email address that is using qat the account in txt local dot co dot uk that is that goes the password and here goes message and click send the message box is appear displaying send successfully now see whether the message is com message is received in my mobile phone or not there you go one message is here click here and click here this is tick support name i just type this is tick support name and click send and you got the message thank you guys for watching this video if you like this video don't forget to subscribe my channel and also give thumbs up and share this video to your friend and thank you once again.